What's that? Oh god. you're back and I'm really glad you're back because I know there's lots of choices there really is and so I know you all love tournament bass fishing because that's what we do here at fish 30 and I'm Dave I'm your host so if you're new to the channel stop subscribe like share comment all that good stuff it helps drive the videos and that's what'll keep this channel free that is my goal I'm not interested in selling memberships and all that kind of stuff I'm just looking for the channel to do well so help us out if you can. Makes a makes a big difference. Really does. Make putting comments on the videos and subscribing. It's free. So let's talk baits real quick. Let's you know I love to jig fish. We're gonna talk jigs real quick. So here's the setting. It's 62 to 64 degrees. Your fish are pulling into spawn. They haven't quite spawned yet, but they are starting to pool up shallow. A lot of guys will start flipping a beaver or a Cinco or even wacky rigs. Here's why I stay with the finesse jig. I just love the finesse jig. A, because it's so easy to hook set out of position. So a lot of times this time of year, <clears throat> those fish aren't biting to eat it. So you don't get the real distinct bite. Sometimes it's just mushy. Sometimes they're just moving off with it. So. A lot of times I'm out of position, and I think it makes a difference to be in position to set the hook to actually land the fish. So when I'm not back in the back of the pockets, lay downs real tight to the bank, thinking about where they're spawning, I'm going to be out on a secondary or even out on the main body, on the main point. I'm going to be throwing a little heavier jig. This is a jewel three-quarter ounce jig. It's in a color called Table Rock Secret. It's really just a green pumpkin and uh, peanut butter with a few strands of chartreuse that I can pull out if I decide I want to. That's a full-size beaver on it, and I've dip-dyed it to give it kind of a, a brim look. So those are the two jigs that we're gonna you're going to see us use. Um, I'm going to show you a crankbait that we're using. Unfortunately, it's a crankbait that I'm not able to replace. So <clears throat> hopefully you guys will have an answer for me. Leave me a comment. I'm going to show you a crankbait. Um, it's a Lucky Craft. It's a uh, it's a 2.5, and it's uh, it's in a Phantom Brown Craw. So um, I know this is a used to be a very popular color, but it's no longer available. Leave me a comment if you've got a brand of crankbait that's still available in this ghost, this clear brown craw, or even a clear green craw. Really love that one too, watermelon. Phantom Craw, I believe they called it. So <clears throat> Carl Schmidt and myself, and we are at Stockton Lake. And uh, we're fishing in the bass world. And uh, we have an encounter with the Missouri uh, Department of Con Conservation, you guys in the, the, the game wardens. Oh, and I'm going to say we'll my hats are off. Real fast, get out of I can't here. remember a better Thank check. You. It went so smoothly. They were so polite. It went fast. If you're a tournament guy and these guys want to check your live well, check your, you're thinking, okay, get on with it, right? And they did. It was very quick, polite, yet we knew what they wanted. And obviously you're going to have your ducks in a row. If you're tournament fishing, you're hopefully going to have all your, everything you need. So it was a great stop. Probably the best one I ever had. On the other hand, the fish that gets away that we lay around on the deck and act the fool. Oh my God, break my heart. I'm telling you, that could be the biggest fish I've hooked in the last three to five years. It's a complete donk and just jumps right by the boat and gets off. And of course, you know, nothing's, we don't doctor much here. So yeah, you see, you see my reaction, it's real. I apologize if that upsets you. We're a little amped up to try to win the tournament. <laughs> 
It's definitely a, it's definitely a guy's happy place. So hey, if this is your kind of thing, subscribe, comment, share the videos on your social media. It helps me grow. It'll help keep this channel free. That's what I really want to do. I don't want it to be a private membership thing that you have to pay for. I want it to be wide open and free. So the way to keep that happening is just by subscribing. It's completely free. It doesn't cost anything. They'll alert you when we release a video. I'm working towards one a week. Everybody knows I'm a part-time YouTuber right now. Maybe someday, but for now I've got a real job and I got teenagers to pay stuff for. So it is what it is. Got to go to work too. So it's probably much like you. But that's okay. We just get us signed up. Well, there he is. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How you guys doing this morning? Well, I didn't hit a deer. I know. Good. <laughs> they were out. Yes, they was. You guys will be boat number 17. Thank you. Three o'clock. Three o'clock. Number 15? Yeah. Okay. You doing all right? Yeah. Is it biting on the trimming? Just need derbies. We got no, no tournaments. There never is when they're fighting. They wait till they stop fighting. Number Tell me the football jig bites on. Come on. Well, my 30th chance. This is live strokes of the devil. <laughs> so says the live strokes of the devil. B -b 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 live strokes, not the devil. That's when he's <laughs> laying down next to it. And he's got his camera up like this dude, and it is one of the funniest.
think that he's actually going to win. I think he has a lot of followers because he's against it. So I think he does it on purpose. Well, he's so he crazy does. about it, but it's fine. Well, hold on. Get, get, get this real. I mean, that one. Big? Yep. It's a keeper, he says. Which way are you going to bring him? Keep him skiing. Keep him skiing. Keep him skiing. Heck yeah, it's a little girl. Boy, I hope she makes it. She got smaller all of a sudden. Oh, almost like you need a bigger hook. <laughs> Come on, girl. 15 and a quarter. 15 and a quarter. She does. I mean, I... We'll see if we get a chance to get rid of her. We're going to get rid of her. We'll keep it just in case. Uh oh, now we gotta make a couple more casts here. I mean, I was literally gonna pull us away. Not by much, but Come on, let me have that one. Don't think he's big enough. It's kind of heavy. Barely makes it. Mine barely. Hard as hell, I too. Know. I stole your whole rod. Hit him hard, dude. Hit him hard. That was a big one. I've seen him, too. Oh, my God. Usually, you don't. Usually, you get that. It's usually 
over on that bank over there, but I want to do them both. All Had him. He stole my pinch. You're gonna have to deal with a jig. You're kidding yourself. So don't get hung up. I'm going to throw right back to where he was. Feel the log. I definitely had a bite twice on that log. Damn. Well, at least they're biting the jig still. Over and then go out. What's that? Oh god. Big, big one too. Help.
Man, I see the GoPro now. I don't remember the GoPro then. You guys doing any good? Yeah. Bass fishing? Yeah, just bass fishing. You guys in a tournament? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, we'll check your permits in real fast. Get out of your hair. You wouldn't think that a person in a permit, uh, in a tournament wouldn't have permits, but it's, it's happened before. several times. I've checked short bass tournaments. Because I'm in the live oil. Yeah. How many people you got in your tournament? You know, I'm not sure about that. I got one of these. Boats, uh, 27 people. Uh, 27 boats. boats yeah. yeah. I printed yeah, it off I too. I got one of those new cards. Okay. Have you seen those? Oh, yeah. So I got a new card. Get this yeah. done real fast and let you guys get right back to it. You guys having a good day? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm in there if you want to look at them. Right out there. What do you have? They're all large mouths. We measured every one of them. They all measure over 15 inch. Okay. Pop open your live well. Which yeah. one do you guys have and which? They're in here. Hold on. Do you want to see? Hop on over. Um, Telling you, that's the only one you have. You're having the other side. No, this Man. one you just got those tags in it. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So always one just about had it. So. All right, check guys. us out on YouTube Fish 30. Well, that's good. I do. It's actually a pretty big town. Phoenix now helps us with this boat. Yeah. <laughs> they, they do. Right. You guys be Fish careful. 30. All one word right okay. on YouTube. There it is. Let the water. Let the water. He might get rid of something. Or is it? We got five. We don't have five. Measure him for us, would you? I don't think so. Now shut. Now it has to be shut. He makes it. Barely. Come on, 10 minutes. Make four, three or four more casts at least. Swing him into the boat. Swing him in. Swing him in, Carl. Swing him in. Swing him in. He's gonna measure, is he? It's a spotted bass. It makes. It's a spotted bass, dude. It only has to be 12. <laughs> Number five. <laughs> you sure it's a spot? It's 
It's got a patch. It's a spot. It's got a patch on its tongue. Yeah. We're gonna call it a spot. Right. Let's go in. Let's go in. Did you get him? Did you got? Did you get him? That's all we got is the little ones. Oh, we lost a giant at the net right at the beginning. So I'll just you just get rolling and jam on the brakes and it shoves it forward. Here, hold that and we'll pump out. And, yeah. Somebody caught him. He did? Oh, of course. That's how it rolls. Every time, you know. Yes. Measure that dude. He makes it. He's small. That's the spot. Yeah. It definitely looks like a spot now. Right? Yeah. 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 Do me a favor. Yeah. Um, crank the front up as tight as it'll go. And when that shuts off, turn that off. Yeah. Right, I'm just going to play these. And we're going to eject out of here. Boat number six. Boat number six. Five fish. Five fish, one big. That's what they look like. I struggle. We struggle. Gold. 395. 395 on the big fish. You got a bigger head than it does a body. Yeah, I'm telling you, we got dinkolas compared to yours. I'd be surprised if we got 10 pounds. And we got a spot. 1397. 1397. Good job. Second place, right? Yeah, I'm sorry you have to look at those little things. <laughs> what right. was your boat number, David? 17. Boat number 17, David McCormick, five fish. That is a spot. Right? That is a spot. Okay. We didn't know it was a mean mouth or a spot. Total weight? Woo! 959, 959. Nine, nine. Thank you, Rick. Put it on, Randy. Right. I enjoy your YouTube. Yeah, thank you. Yep. Good job today. Well, at least it's not you losing the fish, Carl. It's me. <laughs> Jesus. I really don't. A couple bites. I mean... Well, that wraps up Stockton Lake, folks. Yep, and the curse still follows me. I don't know what it is.
Can't seem to keep those big fish buttoned up. Get them in the net. Marietta baits. If it was all the same pole and setup and lure, it, you know, it'd be something. It'd be the line or the boat pole or that. It's probably the guy who's holding it. Letting you down, folks. I apologize. It is what it is. So you can feel the real feeling of tournament fishing, which is not always a very positive thing. It's just how it is. Hey, if this is your kind of thing, though, smash the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Till next time. Thanks for watching. Good morning, sir. How are you doing? Good. Did Philip talk to you about some PDR work? Yeah, a lot of people have. Oh my gosh. How about them poor kayakers? They couldn't even get off the lake. I know. 80, it's 150, isn't it, this yes, year? Yes, sir. Putting more money into the solos like everybody wants. So there's a hundred. There's a hundred. Oh, I think I got a 10. Well, if not, I got change. Do you? Yeah, I got a 10 if you got another 20. That's a one. There you go, sir. Till three. Yes, sir. Everything's the same as usual. 15 inch on everything. Your boat number seven. Lucky seven. Hey, congrats on that wind down there to live in the fish. I'm glad you came to the other day. That's yeah, when they came to Truman last year. We yeah. won that. I know. <laughs> boat seven.